Hi, I'm Brad Holden with Woodworkers Journal. Today we're taking a look at a unique new tool from Porter Cable that we just received. It's called the Restorer. So essentially what this is, is a handheld drum sander. It's got a couple different interchangeable heads and sleeves so that you can accomplish everything ranging from sanding to rust removal to paint removal. Changing the heads out is really simple. Just undo the clips, this one stays in place, and swings open the door. Then, slide it out, slide the new one on, and latch it in place. To use the different sleeves, you simply slide them on to the drum that we had on originally, and replace this with the drum. The Restorer features a 3.5 amp motor, variable speed, and a dust port. Bottom line, however, is how well does it work? Let's give it a spin. Our first test is on this old floorboard from a semi-trailer. One side is rough and the other side is smooth. I started with the coarsest sanding sleeve on the rough side. It easily removed the high spots, but cleaning grooves would require a wire brush. And if I wanted to take this board down all the way, I'd run it through a planer. The dust collection is really effective, and the tool is easy to control. On the smoother, painted underside of the board, again, I started with the coarse sanding sleeve. It gets down to the bare wood pretty easily. Next, I tried the coarse roller. Instead of refreshing the wood, this really just removed the paint, leaving a slightly more distressed look. I could see this as being effective for cleaning up old barn wood, for example, where I didn't want to cut through all the patina and character of the wood. Finally, I moved on to this old metal cart. Using the coarse abrasive drum again, it did a pretty good job of cutting through the paint and taking the surface down to bare metal. I then switched to the padded abrasive sleeve, which is less aggressive than the coarse roller. It just removed the paint, leaving the dark patina of the metal intact. So in using this tool for the first time, I had a couple concerns. Uh, first of all, you know, it's a drum sander, so I was afraid I was going to get ripples like you can get with a floor sander. But as long as you keep the tool moving, that didn't turn out to be a problem at all. Secondly was dust collection, because I'm creating a lot of debris here. And uh, I was pleasantly surprised the dust collection is really very effective. Um, when you're using the sanding sleeves, there really isn't anything that you couldn't be accomplished with a belt sander. Um, what makes this different, however, is the other, um, the other abrasives that you can use that you can't, that aren't available to use for a belt sander. Um, so if you do work that uh, you know, requires you to change the surface or refresh the surface of metal or wood, then the Porter Cable Restorer might be worth a close look.